Welcome back. State Attorney General Mark Brnovich is not holding back on what he thinks about ongoing bogus claims of election fraud. In a high-profile interview with 60 Minutes, he called election deniers in his Republican Party a bunch of, quote, clowns that throw stuff against the wall to see what sticks. Political editor Dennis Welch, live in the newsroom, he got a little spicy there, Dennis. Yeah, it's, he certainly did. Now, remember that Mr. Brnovich was a former supporter of Donald, Tr President Donald Trump. He voted for him in the past, but when it comes to Trump's false claims of election fraud, our attorney general says simply they're not true and describe the unproven and baseless accusations this way. Horse and that's what it is. Most of it's horse and I've been trying to scrape scrape it off my shoes for the last year. Arizona's Attorney General Mark Burnovich using harsh language to describe the election fraud claims made over the past two years by members of his own party. We as prosecutors deal in facts and evidence, and I'm not like the clowns that throw stuff against the wall and see what sticks. Bernovich's comments on 60 Minutes addressing the unproven allegations and audits and investigations since the 2020 election. Despite the claims that the election was stolen, just 12 people have faced charges involving just 12 ballots in an election that was decided by just over 10,000 votes. It's like a giant grift in some ways. A grift, a swindle is what you're saying. Yes. Well, I think A.G. Brnovich is right. It, uh, the election challenges uh, with no facts are horse Former Attorney General Terry Goddard is commending Brnovich for his straight talk. Those conclusions from the AG drawing criticism from both sides, including some who wonder about the timing. Voters have been casting early ballots for weeks, and there is a slate of so-called election deniers running for the top offices in Arizona. I don't feel I can challenge the timing of what AG Bernovich has come out with. He went through an investigation, and investigations, if they're legitimate, can't be predetermined as to result and can't be manipulated as to timing. So. Uh, I'm assuming that he got the results finally and he reported them. And we did reach out to Mr. Bernovich's office for comment and we were told he was unavailable today. Back into you.